Okay, so Olivia has a spur on the top of her toe and from what I can feel, she just has a lot of tension in her feet and she really needs to learn how to massage them, especially on the tops of them. So let's get after that. Okay, let's massage our feet. Take a little bit of oil like that. And put it on the top of your feet. Which one is the bad one? This one? Ooh. Okay. Sorry, y'all. We lost the battery there. You know, sometimes we just need a little lesson and to get going on things, and that's what I think is the case here. So, feel for where it's tight and sore there. Yeah, it's really crunchy. Mm-hmm. Our feet tend to get like acid crystals in them, you know? Uh, yeah. And it's like really that. painful to get them out, but it hurts so good. So, they feel inflamed, okay? They feel puffy. Well, I just ran almost five miles on them. Mm hmm. Might, might be good to spend more time doing this and less time making them more sore which is probably what you're doing with the running so what do you think about that how, how does this feel here that feels good does it feel like it's getting it yeah it feels good so you want to do this and you want to do this uh -huh. and you want to do this and you want to do this I've ever done that. Yeah, this is your head, okay? Uh-huh. This, your toe, relax. Your toe represents your head, is connected to, it reflexes to your head in reflexology. So, there's tension right there. Feels good. You want to do this. Mm -hmm. You want to do all of this. You want to do this. Okay, so try that. Okay. First, I want to get in here. Okay, so I'm going to go grab the soother massage tool. Keep working on that, and I'll be right back. is the soother massage tool and you can hold it really good and this is the large size for you you would use a eh, either one a large or a small large for large hands small for small hands yours are medium and so the soother massage tool is great for massaging this a little oil on there for this. Okay, the inside edge of the feet. So turn this out and I'll show you. Wow. This area, mm -hmm. there's your stomach region or actually and I'm sorry this is the spine the stomach is in here somewhere right in there but this is the spine and oftentimes you can get a cramp right in there if that's really <laughs> and that's, is that really sore <laughs> it feels like a cramp is like this trying to bite down on it yeah when you when you point your foot like that, mm -hmm. if you all of a sudden start getting a cramp in your arch like that, mm -hmm. that's how you test to see if your muscles are tight because a cramp will just come out. 
but you can take the tool and really work it. You can also work mm -hmm. around the edges here. Mm -hmm. You can also work on the toe by holding it like this with one hand. Uh -huh. Crunchy, I can feel the crunchies, crunchies <laughs> in there. But yeah, so try that. So that was always my favorite tool. It's always been my favorite handheld tool for doing massage. Just feel for wherever it's tight and sore. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit sore further back. Let's see what's going on in there. And you can roll, yeah, and roll it. And roll, yeah, you can do that. What is that in there? Ew! It's like dead bodies in there. There are dead bodies in there. Oh my god. I hope not. They might come out, I don't know. I've never felt so much crunchiness. You're doing quite well, Olivia. You're doing well. It's not real. What is that? <laughs> that is strange. <laughs> but isn't that a good little tool? Yeah. Hey. Oh, there's crunchy in that one too. Oh. Now you're getting it. You're getting the hang of that. All those t little toes really help to calm the nerves when you massage all of those crunchies out of there. Like there's something about your ha your fingers and hands and feet and toes that that is just, that's such the best place for relieving tension when you're really stressed. And you may notice that your hands and toes, like they're really, really sore whenever you're stressed. And that's them screaming at you to massage them. Okay, so now I think that we need to get jiggy with this and just get going with the foot friend and yeah. Give me a ride of skateboard. Skateboard. <laughs> I know, maybe you could ride this thing, but it's so much better for massaging your feet. So okay. you yeah, that's about right. Put it on there and start waggling. Back and forth, <laughs> back and forth, digging out the tension wherever it is. Oh, that's interesting. I feel like a little tingling sensation running, tingling sensation running through my toes. Uh huh. Kind of up to my big toe. Uh huh. A little pressure on it. Uh huh. You're very soft spoken, so speak up so people can hear you good. Fine in the spot. Uh huh. It's good. It's really good. I like to dig in and then flex and flex and release. Yeah, yeah, so exactly. Dig in on the spot. Uh huh. You can create action from different things. You're doing good, you're doing good. You're not used to it, so you gotta take it slow. Yeah, and I just finished running, so my feet are like, what are you doing? Yeah. What are you doing? Every runner should have a foot from massage tool. Ah, spread those toes. You can also put the stone in the front and, and curl the toes over the top of the stone and massage right in the front of the ball of the front there you go now lift up mm -hmm. and just waggle it like that yeah 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 get it 
<laughs> That's what you do, you just dig it out. Okay, I want to try the regular foot friend. I'm gonna get my ugly toe. So these are special stones that have sat on the beach in South Africa for probably hundreds of thousands, maybe a million years, getting that smooth. And then I take sandpaper and get them extra, extra smooth on the top. And they make amazing massage tools. And these stones were hand-picked out for me by the only person in North or South America that sells them. And it takes me about four hours to make a foot friend massage tool and they cost about $175. Wow. This is an old beater one, but it still works great and it'll be working great for the next hundred years. So after you buy one, <laughs> You never have to worry about it breaking. It's made with solid maple and or this one has cherry and a stone that's been hanging out for millions of years. That'll never break. But what a massage tool it is. Perfect for runners. Gotta get one. Okay, so okay. now here's the regular footprint. Just a, just a flat piece of wood. Feels very different. Yeah, not the same. Not at all. But it still feels good, eh? Yep. The flat, the flat has its own benefits. Because you can, you can kind of get a bigger surface area done with a flat. Now you haven't worked on your heel yet, so you should try that. Get all the way down onto the heel. Yeah. Now you might find crunchies in there. Never and go like, go like before. this. Yeah. Nothing in there? It feels good, but... Yeah, come right there. Now work it all the way back. Yeah. No, just get out. <laughs> Ah, okay, gotta do the other one. Kinda have to have a little bit of balance on this. Uh-huh. Oh, this one's crunchy. Maybe this is just the crunchy foot. The foot that's working harder. Mm-hmm. Feet. So what do you think? I think it's great. Wow. So really spend some time with your hands working the toes in, in the webs of the toes and you know the, the joints themselves. Mm -hmm. I didn't really show you much of that but work the joints of the toes. There's two in between each one and the tips of the toes and the, 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 to the furrows. Okay so on the top where's my oil? <laughs> Let's do furrows real quick, because we didn't do those. Okay, in massage school, these were called furrows. These places in between the bones. The bones. Right like that. So you can take your fingers or thumb Oh, that's the best right there, like that. And get it <laughs> in between the furrows and the webs. Like when you get to the bottom of the furrow, you can pinch the web. Ah. Now you're talking. Yeah. Okay, 
then move to the next one. And then hold the whole thing like that. And, and work the furrow, the furrow in between. Okay, so right there, that is your liver three point. And that helps your liver to, to get unblocked. If livers get stagnated from fat, fatty liver, that liver three point is supposed to be the ultimate point for releasing, your, the ultimate acupuncture, acupressure point for releasing liver clogging tension problems. Right at the top, yeah, right at the top of that first furrow in between your toe and your second digit there. Toe digit. Mine would do that. Well, let's see. <laughs> <laughs> let's see. All right. Good. I can do it and hold the camera at the same time. Look at you. Look at you. There. My big toe is hating this though. I really got to work on massaging it. You know, whenever there's an imbalance, if you just keep getting more blood flow to the area, mm -hmm. that's, you know, a game changer. More blood flow, because our bodies, they, especially in your feet, sometimes we just they just get clogged and, you know, they get all those crisp acid crystals in them and stuff. and and creating blood flow, movement, lymphatic flow in your body and in your feet. That's what's going to help it to heal. You may need more sleep, but yeah. Hey, Hi. would you like to join us? That is so cool. <laughs> Come learn some foot massage. I, I will next time. Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> Okay, well that's a pretty good thing I just learned. Yeah. Okay. I'm getting hungry. Hey, how's it going? Pretty well, you Hey guys. Okay. This is all the raw side. Um, the olives aren't raw. And this is the cooked side. And that is gluten free. And that's got some calcium and magnesium powder in it. I think I would like to bless this food first. I feel just exceptionally powerful today. I don't know exactly why, but I do. Got a little salt on there. Mm-hmm. Kale. 
So the skeeters were getting after me a little bit, so I put some patchouli on my skin. And I think that that's helping. I have not gotten bit since. Okay, so I'm going to pack up, and I think I'm going to come back tomorrow. And I did get a, get a couple of good videos there. But check out my nice cart. If I didn't have that thing, it would be such a pain. And somebody made a donation last... Uh, Somebody made a donation last couple weeks ago and paid for that cart and I really need that and I use that, as you can see, to help people to learn how to heal. Thank you so much for your donations, everyone. Man, I wish you could see that the way I can see it. It is freaking amazing, that moon.